Zucchinis and squashes. Although treated as a vegetable, they're actually fruit. They originated in Mesoamerica, the same region that gave us and domesticated tomatoes, avocados, and so many other crops. Zucchinis can actually be grown almost anywhere in the world, given the right conditions. Here in North America and other temperate regions, we commonly grow zucchinis from starter plants. This is to get a head start on the season and to ensure a bountiful summer harvest. So in part one of this three-part series of growing your own zucchini right from the start, let's look at how we can properly seed our propagation trays so we can ensure maximum germination for this year's crops. First up, I use the 72 cell propagation trays as the bigger cell size just seems to work better for the larger plants like zucchinis and squash. Fill each cell to the top using a quality organic seeding mix and then remove any large debris that you come across. Level that tray off nice and even and then begin to compress each cell about 25% to eliminate any air gaps. Fill the cells back up level again with that same potting mix and we're almost ready to seed. You gotta water these guys from the bottom with about two liters of warm water and let it sit for around two hours. Once your tray has absorbed all the water, take a pencil or similar instrument and begin to make medium sized holes in the center of each cell. Soaking up the tray previously allows the soil to keep its structure, otherwise this step would be impossible. Looking good now, we're definitely ready to seed. Simply place your seeds in each hole in any orientation. It doesn't matter. And I try to plant mine about half an inch deep. To finish the seeding process, pinch the holes closed, ensuring that each seed is safely tucked into that soil. These guys seed so fast and easy, doing an entire tray should take you less than seven to 10 minutes. Place your completed trays in an area that's 80 to 85 degrees Fahrenheit, and then cover them up to prevent that soil from drying out before germination. With our seeds now set up to germinate and given the best possible chance to sprout, all we need to do now is wait. Zucchini take around three to five days to germinate at 80 to 85 degrees Fahrenheit. So we'll keep an eye on this tray for early next week and we'll prepare for video number two in the series where we help these guys get established for moving into the garden late spring. Hey, thanks for watching guys. If you're getting value in this and the other series that I'm doing on YouTube, hit those like, share and subscribe buttons if you'd be so kind and I'll see you in the next video.